want to talk about last Saturday I do the exploring train station so I want to talk about that about my videos I create and you know just talk about more details for you guys or you don't know behind the scene what it looks like and yeah just talk about what during that day what time do I go how do I transfer to one place to another and what do I do during that day so it's a bit behind the scene and I'll talk about that in a minute so I'll show you a video first and start So how's the video? Like, is it good? Is it bad? Leave a comment below telling me like what can I improve or what can I include more in that video but as you know, just telling me your feedback. So if you have any feedback you want to leave a comment below, you are allowed to leave a comment below always. So so from that day, 8 o'clock, I start to catch a train to the train station I need to film and during that day, my friends have bought a new camera so we went to that camera shop but so during that time we went to a camera shop and my friends have a credit card he wanted to pay because he always used credit card and they, he tell their parents and they just bought it from the credit card but so during that time we wait for two hours to three hours in the shop so at that time we has some problem about the system about the credit card the bank from China to transfer to Australia bank account so at that time we just don't know what to do and he just called his parents and so all the things is step by step he need to do and transfer the money to Australia bank so it takes like few hours to go through all those stuff so it's pretty like not that bad because at least he got a camera during that day and at least he got to play the camera that he can play so i mean he played camera before but it's not a very deep dive about the camera so he just go through like all the settings and of course i teach him some stuff about the camera i use and the camera he bought because the things he bought it's the same as my camera and the school borrow me and I know all the settings so as I said I probably will teach all the things as I know to other people because that can help me to know more about cameras and help me to remember all the settings and of course this kind of camera is most tough things so it's very hard to know all the stuff in this because it's aperture, shutter speed, ISO or all those settings you need to go through because it's probably you need to know as a photographer or videographer. So after buying the camera, we went to a shop to get some food like local food or Chinese food. And so after we having lunch, we went to a train station, start to film, start to take some photos and Last week I took some sick photos as you know if you saw my Instagram account and I upload some moon photos like this one And the next one is the train like I do lots of color grading and some epic stuff so I like color grading because it's make my photos more better and more interesting like if you are Good color grading just telling me and we can compare together in the future if you want I like to work some film together for 
other people so yes in future i'll do some films for other people and people can pay me maybe but yes and now i'm just helping the school and helping myself and yeah just these two things i'm helping me with so if i have new ideas i will start to plan and start to release the plan to telling you guys what am i gonna do in the future maybe next month next month is september it's my birthday of the month so yeah it's getting close and closer so it's less than five weeks it's my birthday so at that time afternoon we take like from one o'clock two o'clock to six o'clock we staying at the train station in the same train station because we were waiting for the sunset so the sunset is epic like it's pretty dope like the sunset and the drone shot include all those things so of course at the beginning i catch a very very nice shot in the drone shot so as you see my films include the trains coming into the station and i take the drone to pull it in and uh, just epic of course before i go do some film i need to plan it first so of course every film i need to plan and before i plan maybe we need to plan because of we don't know what can we shoot or during that day is it raining is it cloudy is it sunny so we need to depend on the weather as well because maybe it's too dark we need to make the setting better so so at the first shot i put a drone shot and that last shot is the drone shot as well so I very like the drone shot, I don't know why, but I just get into it a drone and just flying around and look some epic stuff and I think I'm very lucky like the first shot is very lucky, super lucky like I don't know what happens, it's just take the videos and I just start to record and the train just coming into the station and I just capture that. So during the afternoon we absolutely like so like 40 or 50 train like going in through the station or going out the station i know it's a small station but it's just like what it is so we just choose some random station and just film some stuff and i think that's all for that day like last saturday is pretty dope and it's pretty exhausting like we wake up very early like seven o'clock you know have breakfast and come back night like six o'clock seven o'clock having some dinner at home and that day is just crazy like the film day is always crazy so it's pretty busy during that day and i think that's all for this videos and i'll put the videos again like now